Hi everyone, how are you? Welcome to another question and answer session for MRCS exam. Here, this is the question. A 65 years old man with long standing arterial fibrillation develops an embolus to the lower leg. The decision is made to perform an embolectomy utilizing a transpopliteal approach. After incising the deep fascia, which of the following structure will the surgeon encounter first on exploring the central region of the popliteal fossa. So now we have to find out the key points here that the central region of the popliteal fossa when it explodes, surgeon encounter first. That means the which structure present most superficially in the popliteal fossa. Here's the options. The options are popliteal vein, common peroneal nerve, popliteal artery, tibial nerve and none of the above now let's see the figure here we can see this is the popliteal fossa here it is a diamond shaped space it is bounded by different type of the muscles and here we can see here the content of the popliteal fossa and we can see most superficial this is a tibial nerve in central region this is the central region this is the central region of the popliteal fossa and in this central region there is the tibial nerve so the tibial nerve it lies most superficially then we can see this is a vein which is the popliteal vein and then popliteal artery so in the popliteal fossa most superficial is tibial nerve then popliteal vein the popliteal artery and we can see another nerve which is the common fibular nerve or common peroneal nerve it lies in the lateral side of the popliteal fossa so this content and this relation is very very important for the popliteal fossa and in this picture it is very obvious that this is the sciatic nerve sciatic nerve divides into the tibial nerve and common peroneal nerve tibial nerve it enters into the popliteal fossa centrally and common peroneal nerve it runs laterally in the popliteal fossa and this tibial nerve it lies more superficially than femoral then popliteal vein then popliteal artery and we can see the popliteal artery is the most deepest structure that means it is very close to the bones So now it is our answer that the tibial nerve, tibial nerve, it lies most superficial in the central region of the popliteal fossa. And uh, they are the contents of the popliteal fossa, the, uh, the popliteal artery and popliteal vein, a small saphenous vein, common peroneal nerve and tibial nerve, the common peroneal nerve and tibial nerve, they derive from the sciatic nerve, then posterior cutaneous nerve of the thigh genicular branch of the optodictal nerve and limb nerve. Thank you all.